And Saka gets it through and Bellingham tries to tee up Palmer. Chelsea fans, brace yourselves because we're diving into something that might stir up some serious debate. Is Cole Palmer better than Eden Hazard? Yeah, I know, that's a pretty bold statement. Hazard was an absolute beast at Chelsea, but Palmer's recent form is making everyone sit up and take notice. So, let's break this down stats, performances, style everything, stick around, and by the end of this, you might just have a different opinion on who's king at Stamford Bridge. First, let's give Hazard his flowers. Between 2012 and 2019, he was Chelsea's main man across 352 games. Hazard scored 110 goals and provided 92 assists. That's incredible. He wasn't just a stat machine. What set Hazard apart was his ability to turn games around almost single-handedly. Think of those solo runs through entire defenses or those inch-perfect passes. Two Premier League titles, two Europa League titles, and a Player of the Year award prove his influence was undeniable. But now, in 2024, we've got a new kid on the block, Cole Palmer. He's making waves, and his numbers are starting to rival some of the best in the game. Let's talk stats, shall we? As of October 2024, Palmer is already one of the Premier League's top performers. He's contributed more combined goals and assists than Erling Holland. That's right, more than Holland, and he's just behind Harry Kane. For a player who's made only 38 professional starts, that's insane. During his time at Chelsea, he has scored 31 goals and provided 20 assists in 54 games. Palmer's ability to deliver in big moments has been key. He's already put himself in elite company by contributing to four goals in a single game, joining the ranks of very few legends. Hazard had his big moments, but Palmer's rapid rise is impossible to ignore. You know who else would join the rank of few legends? You would, but only if you like and subscribe. Comment who you think is better. Back to the video. And then there's Palmer's efficiency. Advanced stats show us that he is one of the most efficient players in the Premier League, and his finishing is also on another level. Palmer ranks in the top 5% of finishes across Europe, scoring 0.2 goals per 90 minutes more than expected. That means he's creating one goal out of nothing every five games and ability Hazard had in his prime. Let's compare how they did in their first season at Chelsea. Eden Hazard was 22 compared to Cole Palmer, who was 21 in his first season with Chelsea. Hazard managed to score 13 goals and provide 21 assists in 61 games. Cole Palmer has a significantly bigger impact with 27 goals and 15 assists in 48 games. Hazard's best season came in the 2018-19 season when he scored 21 goals and assisted 17 in 52 games, resulting in a 0.73 goal and assist ratio. Cole Palmer, this season, has scored 6 goals and assisted 5 in 9 games, resulting in a 1.22 ratio. However, I would be very impressed if Cole Palmer kept up the whole season like he does right now. Let's talk about how they compare on the pitch. Hazard was known for his dribbling and creativity. He would glide past offenders like they weren't even there. Palmer's game is slightly different, more clinical, more direct. He operates best in the right half space, drifting between being a number 10 and playing wide. This allows him to find pockets of space, pull defenders out of position, and create scoring chances for himself and others. You can see it in Palmer's heat map, he thrives in the areas that matter most. That's where he's been deadly this season, consistently creating goal-scoring opportunities. Hazard, on the other hand, was more of a playmaker and dribbler, operating across the entire attacking third. While Hazard had flair, Palmer has precision. When it comes to defensive contributions, Palmer also brings something different to the table. Hazard wasn't particularly known for his defensive work rate. Palmer, on the other hand, ranks high in pressing, often leading Chelsea's counter-press after losing possession. This adds another layer to his game that Hazard didn't consistently offer. So, where do we land in this debate? Is Palmer already better than Hazard? Well, it's tough to say outright. Hazard's legacy is secure his performance as one Chelsea titles, and he was consistently one of the best players in the world during his time. But Palmer, despite being so young, is showing signs that he could surpass Hazard if he continues at this rate. His goal contributions, ability to deliver in big moments, and defensive work rate already make him a more complete player in some aspects. Palmer's future is incredibly bright, and it's scary to think he's still just getting started. Is he already better than Hazard? Maybe not yet, but could he be in the near future? Absolutely. Now, it's your turn. Drop a comment below who do you think is the better player? Hazard or Palmer? Let's get the debate going. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell to stay tuned for more football debates just like this one.